In order to spray paint with zero orange peel, it has to be sprayed on wet. And I did this to show you that it doesn't matter what your settings are or what gun you're using. Wetness is the key to not having orange peel. Dry spray equals orange peel. It's easy to spray a flat surface and not get any orange peel. You can get it as wet as you want without worrying about runs. The side of the car, though, is much different. You have body lines, wheel well lips, and other obstacles you have to work around. That forces you to be more careful and spray it a bit drier, which leads to orange peel. Since gravity and other variables are working against you while spraying side panels, it's best to be safe and spray a little drier than the flat panels such as the hood, roof, and deck lid. It's much easier to buff out a little orange peel then try to remove runs. We painted this car in some pretty warm weather, so the paint dried quickly and didn't have a lot of time to flow out or lay down flat, so it was lightly wet sanded and buffed. To knock down your orange peel a bit, you don't have to go crazy. We just sanded this lightly with some 1500 grit dry on a DA with an interface pad. It's a bit soft and just went over it real light, just knocking it down a little bit. Then we got a buffer with a wool pad and wheeled it out with some mirror glaze number 85. We finished up with McGuire's Ultimate Polish and a light coat of turtle wax. And I've never really had a problem using wax after painting, although we did let this dry for about a week. We'll pull this out and see what it looks like outside. There's plenty of claims out there that you can spray a car with no orange peel. But the truth is it's very difficult, especially with cheaper clear coats, paints, and other variables when dealing with vertical panels. It's usually better to play it safe. Do your best to lay it down flat, but if there's a bit of orange peel, that's okay. It's better than pushing it and getting runs. I hope you enjoyed this video on the truth about orange peel and all the repairs on this 2016 Chevy Sonic. If you did, and you'd like to get my latest videos, don't forget to hit the subscribe button.